Hi ladies, it's Erin and welcome back to my channel. So continuing my fall winter fashion trends series, I wanna talk a little bit about accessories. Accessories are such a great way to infuse some interest into our wardrobe, such an affordable way, such an easy way. It doesn't matter what size you are, it doesn't matter what age you are. So this is where I would say you can really try to experiment. You can really play around a little bit. It's not a huge investment um, and it's just fun. Accessories are really fun. So I wanna walk through some of the bigger accessory trends. And again, just because something is a trend doesn't mean you have to wear it or you have to try it. Um, certainly a lot of these things come and go pretty quickly, but if you do see something that resonates with you, if you do hear about something that you wanna try, why not? You know, this is a great way, um, you know, adding a pair of earrings or adding a necklace or adding a belt or adding a handbag, that's an easy way to infuse a little bit of excitement and freshness into your wardrobe in the fall season. So. Let's get going on the accessories. The first one, the most important, the most prevalent accessory trend are chokers. It's everything from really skinny chokers, just a simple strand of leather, or a simple ribbon across, to really wide, thick chokers, to chokers that also have um, a lot of, that can wrap around a bunch of times and are long, like a lariat. Um, I happen to buy one from Bobble Bar that's a lariat choker. I like that option because I think with the longer straps, it does draw the eye down a little bit. I like the thinner strap in the middle. It doesn't um, highlight so much of the neck. As you guys know, as you get older, it's a tougher area to kind of highlight. It's much nicer to highlight sort of the collarbone area, the chest area versus the neck, especially, you know, as we get into our 40s and 50s and 60s, 70s, our necks are not the greatest part. So you want to consider that before trying this trend, like how am I feeling about my neck? How does my neck look? Do I want to highlight that? Maybe I want to just try the thin strap and then the lariat version like I have, or maybe you do want to try a thicker one and just cover up everything on your neck, which is another option, kind of like a turtleneck. So um, you also want to consider how thick is your neck? How long is your neck? Um, is that a feature you really want to highlight? So the choker is really going to highlight the neck. You want to make sure that's a feature you feel good about. Um, again, but if you don't feel 100% good about it. You can try the longer version or you can try the thicker version that covers up everything. So that's the biggest trend. That's the most important trend. I would say accessory trend for fall. Um, pearl necklaces. I don't know when these ever go out, but they're certainly um, back in. Long pearl necklaces, layered pearl necklaces, pearls with edgy or detailing. Um, so pearls are really on trend. This trend I'm a little bit unsure about. I don't know how you guys feel about it, but the one big earring with no earring on the other side or one big statement earring with a smaller earring on the other side, um, that is something that was all over the runways. It's, um, it's interesting. I think it's unique and it certainly would make a statement. I guess it just depends on your style personality, what your comfort level is. Um, I like symmetry and I like to have two earrings, um, the same size, same earring. So I think I'll probably steer clear of that one, but maybe that's something that really appeals to you and that sort of mix and match jewelry um, goes throughout. So you could have, you know, bunches of rings on one hand that don't even match the earrings that you have. It's just, you know, that mix and match eclectic accessory trend going strong. Another one I probably won't jump on, but maybe it fits more with your style personality is goth or sort of punk rock look. You know, again, it's back to the chokers with the thick leather chokers, but lots of silver chain detailing, um, lots of black leather. So, you know, that is very dependent on, on what your comfort level is. Raw stones and crystals are another one. A lot of jewelry necklaces, pendant necklaces, earrings, rings with raw stones, crystals. Um, one of the styling trends, I would say, is a watch or a bracelet over your shirt, over your lightweight knit. Um, just something to think about. You could, you know, during the fall winter season, a lot of times we don't wear bracelets because you don't see them. And so this could be a way to show off your, your bracelets and your watches um, during that season without them getting lost. You can just put them over your shirt. Um, ear crawlers have been around for a couple seasons and they're still going strong and those are the ones that sort of literally crawl up your earlobe. 
those big oversized statement necklaces are still very much on trend and it's a great way to add a lot of impact to your look it's an affordable way to add a lot of impact to your look. It doesn't matter what your body type is. It doesn't matter what your age is. So I would take advantage of the statement necklace. In contrast to the statement necklace are the really dainty layered necklaces. And what's nice now is that there are so many options that are already layered for you. So you don't have to worry about buying multiple necklaces and then mixing and matching and figuring out how to best layer them. They come pre-layered. Um, the trick with those is that you just have to really keep them um, hanging or keep them in some sort of storage system or they're not going to get all tangled up because they do tangle quite easily. And then the last um, accessory trend I would say are the brooches. There's a lot of brooches, you know, brooches are coming back. And then also um, hairpins, you know, brooches as hairpins or just hairpins, um, which is a really elegant look lovely sort of um, Victorian look. I love a brooch on a scarf or a brooch on a dress or like a cluster of brooches on a dress could be really pretty. Those are the standout accessory trends for fall. Let me know if you have any questions at all guys. Um, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Um, and also the blog. Remember, I'm going to put accessory suggestions on the blog, so I'll have plenty of chokers over there for you guys to check out. And um, yeah, let me know if there's any other questions or anything else you'd like to see, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.